individually. Dino Vigo, Chris Clark, Omar Thompson, John Moses, and Sergio Chacon had struggled in their careers as stand-up comedians. Together with Capone's guidance, they would form the first comedy boy band, The Five Mikes. Immediately, they were catapulted into megastardom, passing Dane Cook, Cat Williams, and the Beatles. It was the road they walked together that would eventually tear them apart. We look back at the triumph, the tragedy, the laughter, and the bitches of the Five Mikes. Where are they now? The Five Mikes definitely started from my vision of, um, you know, bringing five black guys to the arena. And then I found out that uh, white people are not going to pay to see five black guys unless they wearing uh, basketball jerseys and running up and down the court. So I had to rethink this whole thing. And I said, what is going to make this where everybody can enjoy it? So I went and got a, a Puerto Rican and a, a white guy. The five mics were able to start playing major venues nationwide almost from the beginning of the band's conception. Their performances matched the hype, quickly becoming a nationwide phenomenon overnight. Success soon began to drive them apart. Omar Thompson landed a role in Ice Cube's Last Friday, hopefully. Chris Clark began skipping rehearsals. When he did show up, he was late, and the others suspected drug use. I'm late. The five began to complain of fatigue as demand increased. Shows, appearances, and rehearsals began to take their toll. Come on, Sergio, man! Work on your spins, man! I'm a comedian, man. I didn't sign up for this. Sergio, I don't want to be prancing around the stage either. But it's part of showbiz. Man, why you always touch me for? What's up with that vest? Omar Thompson wanted to leave the group. Cap, you got a second? I'm leaving the group. I'm going solo. Take you out to fly. I will be in the group. Trust me. I will be you want to fly? You'll be flying by yourself, player. Go fly solo. I'm not going to leave the group. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to leave the group. Fly my. Say it again. Fly my. Yes. The band's final performance was scheduled for August 25th, 2013, at Madison Square Garden. The show never happened. Ah! Ah! Oh! We catch up with the five mics ten years later. I'm always going to be part of the five mic. I mean, that band was like my family. And I know a few of the guys are mad at Omar and at his success, but you know what? I'm not. I'm happy for him. He deserves it. I can't complain. I'm content with my life. I mean, look at this. I'm surrounded by water and beauty. Sergio. 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 Hey, Sergio. Yo, man, we got to spill out in front of the restaurant. What? People are starting to complain. Can you right, right, right. Out, man? Right, I got you. I got you. Yo, I need you here, bro. I got you. This is you. I got this job for Sergio about six months ago. He's had some sort of break with reality. He thinks uh, the five mics are still going on or something. Anyway, after I stabbed Omar, uh, I got a couple of months. And when I got out, I started doing shows again. Uh, you know, I felt like I was making a comeback. Then one night after a show, uh, you know, I saw this beautiful woman. You know, the club was 21 and over to get in. Anyway, after I got out of jail again, my probation officer got me this job. Hey, yo, John. Customers are complaining. They're finding red hair in their food. Where's your hand at? Yo, man. 
Bitch ass internet. After the five mics split up, Dino Vigo started to delve into different forms of artistic expression. After the five mics broke up, I felt like I needed a lifestyle change. Uh, actually, I don't even go by the name Dino anymore. I go by Denicia. Chris Clark spent the last seven years in and out of rehabs. You said the five mics. Man, forget the five mics. Give me five dollars. I know VH1, BET, y'all getting all that money. Y'all seeing money. Cap got money. I know he still got me. I need five dollars. God damn it. You said you was going to get me a cheeseburger. A cheeseburger. I'm hungry. All you doing is popping and locking. You ain't getting me no cheeseburger. My stomach hurts. Shut up. I'm trying to get that money right now. Give me five dollars. 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 Mike, I, I can do a car wheel. Woo! Check it out. Yo, crazy. Thick. Give me five dollars. Give me five dollars. Out of the five mics, Omar Thompson was the only one to go on to continued success, starring in several feature films, such as Free Willy 27 and Iron Man X, before winning an Oscar for his critically acclaimed role in Broke Black Mountain. Omar won an Oscar? Man, I am Oscar. I'm living in a trash can. Give me five dollars. 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 That's right. See, what people don't understand is that I own the five mics. I am the five mics. Five mics is just bigger than any five guys. Trust me, it's big. And when I say it's big, it's big because I created it. The five mics will go on forever. It's eternal. Five, five mics. mics. Hadouken.